What's good, YouTube? How y'all doing, man? Welcome to a brand new video. As you can see, I just hopped on the game, fresh in the morning. So make sure y'all drop a like on the video for me getting this out to y'all and trying to be the first person to get it to y'all. The draft is today, Tuesday, I mean Thursday, April 26th. And as you can see, man, this is what I hopped on to, man. It says, uh, as each prospect gets drafted, the rookie and future star version will be released in mud. Rookies will be in packs, and future stars will be unlockable through their player-specific sets. So you can unlock the future stars through solos, and the rookies going to be in sets. Um, there will be a special limited-time content released throughout the first round, such as solo challenges with boosted rewards, blitz types, and pack offer and special players. So basically, if y'all want special players, go ahead and be online while the draft is going on and do the solos try to get those knocked out so you can get those special players because obviously you know what i'm saying uh the special players is gonna be during the draft now today they also release olivia vernon and marcus Mariota, but we don't care about none of that man we don't care about none of that all we worried about is the draft now let's go into the solos okay so you get a free 95 overall by Finishing these sets, that's 32 solos, 77K, 16 items. That's not bad, 77K, man. And it looked like the solos are kind of simple. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and I'm going to just go ahead and see how simple they are. It, it looked like they're on rookie. Uh, they go up as you go. So, I mean, it's 36 solos, though, y'all. I mean, that's a lot of solos. The highest it goes up to is all pro, so that's not bad. But like I said, you do get 77 tokens. I mean, 77K, which is a decent amount of money. Now, let's go ahead and go into the sets because I don't know what cards they're going to drop. Because let's see. See, they haven't even they just they haven't even dropped the sets. Okay, cool. So they just showing. Okay, okay. So the draft masters are going to. Okay, okay, okay. So you get. Future stars, you get a 98, a 97, a 96, and a 95. So let's see. Uh, they ain't even putting nothing in the set to show us. But as you can see, okay, so go ahead and stack up on your tokens, your gold and silver tokens. You can get five badges. This is a perfect time to do the token method and sell your badges because, I mean, sell your uh, silver to gold tokens right now. This is the perfect time. Um, but as you can see, I think the 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 draft masters is four and four net. Okay, so you get you're gonna get five cards out of completing this set. That's cool. That's that's cool. I, I like that. I like that. So one silver and one gold could get you that many badges. That's kind of clean. But if if you need five NFL draft badges for one, that means you're gonna need at least a hundred. I'm gonna say roughly around a hundred to get uh any set master so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and see if the cards went up right now see if the silver cards went up or the gold of course the gold cards probably went up but let's just let's just check the tokens first we'll check the tokens to see if they went up before we go oh let's see let's see okay yeah they went up a little bit they basically doubled in price yeah, let's check the silver. Yeah, they went up to about 8K. That's that's pretty cool. I mean, that's not bad. They, I say they're probably going to reach a higher price depending on what cards come out. But it, it, it obviously doesn't matter what uh, gold or silver token you put in a set. It just matters the gold or silver token. So, yeah. Basically, this... this the What I should tell What I'm going to tell you right now. This is what I would do if I were y'all, man. The best thing to do right now is do your solos before the draft starts, right? Because knock out as many solos as you can. I'm going to talk while I do a solo and see how easy it is. But knock out as... Oh, I, don't, I ain't even got enough players. I ain't even got enough players to run a team, I don't think. <laughs> That's to show you how long I ain't did no solos. But what I would do is I would run my solos until if you got time run them all the way up until the draft start and then when the draft starts stay on the game and then unlock the new solos right so you're gonna unlock the new solos and then while you're unlocking the new solos do the new ones and save those 32 ones for later until they're done because remember you they're gonna unlock new solos during the first round 
Now, I don't know, the first round is one day. So what they might do is they might do the first round and then they might say, okay, like the next day, we're gonna do a second round one. So you might be able to get like hidden, there might be hidden cards in the first round that you won't be able to get in the second round. So it, my suggestion would be do the solos for the first round as soon as they come out, do those challenges and, and, and hidden solos because if they're doing it the way I think they would be, they're only gonna keep that solo open for one day, like, kind of like the boss battles is. And then after the one day, you won't be able to do it. So what I would do is I would capitalize on the solos that I can before the draft. And then when the draft hits, at the time the draft hits, I would stop doing the solos and then only do the solos that they the open for the draft. Now these solos right here are, it's definitely going to be too long. As you can see, that's three minute quarters. That's a that's a long solo. Uh, I, in my opinion, they're ripping us for our time. Yeah, they're not. They're not. Uh, they're definitely not, no. I I don't suggest you to do these 32 solo challenges. That's just me and my opinion. I mean, 72k. If you if you really need the money, then go ahead and do it. But I don't suggest you to do these 32 solos. That's gonna take way too long. You talking about three minute quarters? Nah, that's way too long. That's just that's just a tease, bro. Like, that's way too much time to do to get 77k in my opinion. I don't think you should do these solos. But like I said, if you want to do these solos all the way up until the draft starts, then by any means go ahead and knock that out. But then make sure once the draft starts and they get into that first round, make sure you guys are doing the solos that they offer to you guys. Because if you do that, you might get a hidden card, a hidden boss, or, or, or you know, it might be some solos that's worth your while in that first round. So make sure you guys are capitalized on that first round. And that's really all I got for this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm, I tried to get this out to, to you guys first. And I just want to let you know, if you get to the point of the solos, you know, don't try to knock out all 32 in one day. Do as many as you can up until that first round and then stop. And uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys destroy the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Turn on your notifications so you see every one of my videos. And I'm out.